Okay, for anyone thinking about the U.S. carburation conversion on the Honda EU 7000 IS, this is the uh, this is the demand regulator mounting situation. Um, so it's awfully far out, but uh, more important than that. It looks like this bracket's not actually made for this particular machine. Here we are underneath. And uh, you can see that the uh, this, this thing here is the bracket. It's hard to uh, illustrate, but it's... Uh, it looks like it's intended to clamp around this frame piece. Although in the in the instructions they refer to this as an axle. But I don't know, maybe that's just carry over from another um, from another guide on another machine, but. Here's what happens is that the, uh, see it's the, uh, it's right against the, the uh, plastic cover. Uh, so the uh, end of it can't, can't reach the bottom of the generator like it seems to be intended to do. Um, seems like this regulator should be a lot farther in um, and you know it also seems like this um, this little plate here is uh, just Uh, it's just hitting the the cover, so it seems like it needs to hang under the bar. This, you know, that's not an axle. Just just to be clear, it's uh, some kind of a you know, just like a grab grab rail or something. I've I've tried this. And I really feel like I got the wrong bracket. What do you think, guys? It comes closer to working with just a U-bolt. Uh, um, you know, it positions the regulator down lower. But, um, you know, you don't have the, the interference with the... With the um, Shroud. Of course, the uh, the thing that's intended to rest against the bottom. Where is that? Yeah, the thing that's. See, it actually would work pretty good if the uh, if the um, bracket was just straight instead of bent. But as it is, it's. You know, the tab is way out of line. But you know, if it was if it was just straight it might might work. The other concern I had is the instructions make it seem like we're gonna run the uh, supply hose through the battery door, through the knockout in the in the battery door. But if you look at what's right behind that, it's a uh, There's a, uh, you know, there's a connector right there. So you could not run the, could not run the hose right there unless you took the, got rid of the wire, the plug, and then it's not really clear how. Now, once you did do that, let's say you got rid of that, you got this module jammed in there. 
so it's not really clear how you would get a hose even through there because it's just not much space once you have all that stuff up on top of the battery like that it's pretty much shoved up against the, the wiring harness in the back and um, so maybe the unit that they designed for it wasn't exactly like this one but I, I just don't I just don't see how that gets through to where the, the gas needs to go. All right, guys.